because of their involvement in organ harvesting and trafficking. Thank you. Presenting petitions. Honourable member for South Okanagan, West Kootenai. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and I rise here today to present a petition from 120 uh, young people in my riding that point out that the impacts of climate change are accelerating in Canada and around the world and leading to Canada declaring a climate emergency. Canadian youth are anxious that they are being left with an uncertain future. They point out that Canada has endorsed the Paris Agreement to limit global temperature rise to well below 2 degrees, and yet greenhouse gas emissions continue to rise in Canada. And they also point out that subsidizing fossil fuel production is not compatible with the stated goal of reducing greenhouse gas emissions. And therefore, these uh, petitioners uh, call upon the House of Commons to take meaningful steps to support the future of young Canadians and fulfil Canada's obligation under the Paris Agreement by adopting a detailed climate action strategy that includes legislated uh, science-based targets for a greenhouse gas reduction and implementing a comprehensive and steady rising, steadily rising national carbon price beyond 2022 that rises to at least $150 per tonne by 2030.